Hello there and welcome back everybody to Hold the Dragon Queen our D&D 5e weekly show. And we're back uh, with our second segment this week. <laughs> the prayers are currently in the porch uh, of the map we see over on here. And a pair of um, dragon winds mounted on wyverns are searching for them. Um, so from the stats that I have here in front of me and again... Wizards of the Coast, do not release please monsters in a book and then say that the more detailed statistics are in the next book because that's shitty. Don't do that. Um, these creatures yes. actually Thanks can, um, they have they don't have a big wisdom uh, bonus to this. So this one it's with an 11 it's misses. Int. Sorry, int. Still zero. And let's see the last guy. What do you mean the last guy? I thought there was the last guy. There was four. Two weapons and two two dragon wings. Uh, the second dragon wing, a 14 is the minimal. Does it have any bonus? No, no, nothing. 14 is 14 to make. 14 to make, though. Why do, so all four of them get individual ones? Yeah, definitely. Okay. You four would get that individual means, ones. I think that means we get found out, right, for Stani? Stani? Uh, what happened? Let's just check the... Uh, physical interaction with the image is a an illusion because things can pass through the creature's action. To examine the image can determine that it's an illusion with successful investigation check of spell safe DC. If a creature discerns illusion for what it is, the creature can see through the image. Okay, so... so I guess he immediately just goes shit bat, bat crazy. Uh, yeah. He just, so, he just goes like... You, you hmm, don't know... For you don't know he... You don't uh, know illusion. He, uh, you mm -hmm. don't know he actually sees through it because you can't really figure that out uh, in the first seconds. But after that, um, roll me a perception check. Like who? Both of us or just any you? anybody looking at him? Roll me a perception. No, check. I think both of you get it because that's the yeah. seems like the theme of the uh, currently. That if has if it's always been the, that has always been the theme. There has um, never I'll, been I'll a roll one thing for my I'll roll one for my uh, my square. Yep, Do it. 15. Um, no, you guys don't see anything. It doesn't seem like he actually uh, sees for it now. What? Okay. Yeah, he does, he's not affected by seeing you whatsoever. Uh, so you just can you can only assume that he doesn't actually see you. No. Anybody else going the perception? I'm asleep. So okay. I think everybody else is just asleep. So they turn around and uh, start moving, and you see them like coming, just talking, uh, casually talking, and they go on the weapons, mount them up, and then they charge you. So now, I want you to give me initiative. Of course. The people that are asleep are in a surprise zone. Everybody else, I'm gonna say that you have. Am, am I surprised though? Really? Yes. Yes. It, I your, rolled a twenty. Your friends did not wake you up when this happened. They were quite. They were quite silent. So, I, and your friends were still alive, uh, awake, was and was standing, was still casting spells. I have a seventeen. I have a four. Oh well. Okay. So. Uh, Let's see what the creatures would be doing on their initiative orders. The two, wow. Um, so, 11 for the Wivens with a dex of nothing. That's just an 11. 20 for the Cultists. Do they all fit in here? You mean Brutus have an armor on? Actually, sorry, 23 no. for the Cultists. I slept with my armor on. I don't care how uncomfortable it is. Uh, if you sleep more than. Did you sleep last night with your armor on as well? No. No. Because we were in a safe room then. Yeah. Okay, that's cool. You can sleep one night with your armor on. Uh, any other night after that, sleeping with your armor on gains exhaustion levels. Especially heavy armor. Okay, uh -huh. so yeah, you can definitely fit in here, Faye. Uh, every square equals five feet. And you basically, oh, okay. you're like here. You like end the tunnel over around here, casting like there's a minor illusion. Uh, sorry, a, a silent image in front of you. Trying to cover, like make you f seem like a part of the wall. Uh, but this man has seen through you, and the Wivens are charging. How tall is a Wiven? Just asking. Uh, the Wivens are large creatures. Uh, they're about eight feet tall, but they're more like they're more big oh. rather than they are tall. But could 
I mean, can they fit in a tunnel behind us? Um, no. So looking back into the tunnel, they would definitely not be able to fit into the tunnel. The wings alone span about 10 feet from side to side. And there's barely, there's barely four, maybe, f like three, maybe four feet from side to side in that tunnel there. Mm-hmm. Okay, so uh, the cultists will be going first. Um, so they will be taking out their weapons. Let me see what uh -huh. weapons they have. Uh, they're going to take out their weapon, the scimitars, uh, and just actually start moving towards you, but you're a bit surprised. They tap their chests, and they don't start to actually move, they, they fly. The two, the two dragon wings fly above, and then drop down both on Rostani. Alright. Okay, so both of them are they're going to, to and attack you, well uh, and they're going to attack you with an advantage because of the fanatical advantage. Nineteen and nineteen on both dice on first attack. Uh, second uh, attack, yep. eleven and seventeen <laughs> with their bonuses. That would be a uh, twenty-one and a nineteen total on the both on the two attacks. So both yep. of those hit. And they will be doing this amount of damage to you. This is the first attack. And this is the second attack. Okay, 25. Okay, next in line after that. Um, let's see, who do we have? Um, let me do a fast initiative order on my book over on here. Um, so, Brutus, your old initiative on the 21. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, you're still in the surprise zone, so you get, don't get your turn this time because you're asleep. Um, Brenda would be next. Brenda, you're awake. What do you do, Brenda? Mm -hmm. So, well, you're not going to draw a map for us for this encounter, I guess. Do you, um, do you, what, what, do you want to? The uh, wyverns it, are it, literally maps just... Maps always make things easier for me, but... Um, uh, if you really feel like you can't uh, use your character without a map, just, I'll scribble something up. No problem, just tell me. That's kind of insulting to say if you feel you can't use your character without a map. Uh, sorry, so I'm, going to, be I'm just like, saying it is you... easy, I'm not saying it's impossible. So, um, because I don't know how we are standing into, you know, like where we are in relation to them if we change position. You're basically huddled up, so imagine like in a 15 foot square, you're kind of all sitting in that square. Rostani in the front because she was casting the spell. Yeah. And you can be near her because you are awake and she was the only one awake, so that makes so sense. So Rostani's in front, I'm behind her, and, and there are two, what, attacking her? Cultists? Uh, two her? dragon wings attacking them. Dragon attacking her. Okay. Also, Rostani, you owe me that concentration check to see if you keep up the silent image. Because the weapons still don't actually see through it. Silent image is in oh. concentration. It is concentration. It is? Yeah. Oh, did you actually take damage? Uh, he yep. took 14 two damages. Oh wow. Okay. Two damage scores. So is that it's gonna be just DC ten, right? Uh yeah, just DC ten. No, it's it's the damage. Is it damage in half or DC like you know, it has to be like over There's uh it's whichever is higher. Let me look it up. No, I'm pretty sure like it's like the damage and like you have the damage and that's like yeah, or like oh it's DC ten. Like if so if the damage is like twenty two it becomes 11 DC. Okay, so that'll be just a DC 10. I'm just looking it up. Uh, it's it's twice this is of... Yeah, yeah, so I have to roll it twice. Yeah, two, you just need to make two 10s. Which I don't, so yeah. whatever. Yeah, signed image goes down, the weapons now see you. Uh, so, Brenda, go on. Okay, um... I think I'm just going to check one of the... It's, it's 10 or half the of... damage you take, whichever number yeah. is higher. Yeah. Yeah. yeah was, okay, was, so what Brenda's uh, going to do is she's she's going to uh, pick up the she's going to take take her bear hood. She's going to like pull it down over her face so you can basically <laughs> it goes all the way over to to like you know, you only can see her her mouth now. And then what is what is actually quite interesting, if you would watch her and if you wouldn't be asleep you'd see that, that she's actually growing a beard. Right. Yay, and then yay. and then you hear <laughs> and then she rages and charges into battle. 
Okay. Yeah, uh, yeah, do you yeah, attack? Yeah. Do you go for the weapons or do you go for the cultists? I go for the. I guess you said they're dragon wings that are attacking Rastani. I'd go for them first. Yeah. Yeah. You usually saw men with black dragon masks and uh, yeah. black cro cro uh, sorry, no. cloaks flying in the air from the backs of ribbons, dropping down in front of Rastani and starting to slice her up. It's yeah. it's not that it's homebrew, Simon, by the way. It's just that in the Horde of the Dragon Queen module, it's plus three. The one in the uh, DMG is plus two. That's very weird. Well, no, because they were still in development when they released uh, Horde of the Dragon Queen. Ah, uh, I see what you mean. Like, a lot of the magic It doesn't items... matter either way because it hits my AC with shield anyway. I'm just saying. It, it is right. plus, you, the ones you have are plus three, unless Trek yeah. wants to change it. No, no, it's okay. plus three. That's what I gave you last time because that's what you identified. I thought you were making a mistake, but whatever. No. Me? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> like, are you talking about this right now? <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Um, I thought, like, yeah. yeah. I thought it was like, ah, oh, no, because the base of defense this plus is, two. Or this whatever. is, yeah, this is like a wizard if thing. If it's just that... plus three in the uh, module, that's fine. Yeah, it, it it's does. just an annoying okay. like wizard thing. Don't release items or NPCs that you don't actually have described fully in the book that you're releasing. But, right. eh. Fuck okay. them. We'll just play a game. Okay. Yeah, well, I'm just going to roll this. So Brenda, show me. Show me what you can do. I take the first one, which is the night. Okay, 19 is a hit. Yeah, definitely. Holy shit, you have plus 8 to hit? Maybe. Um, fuck. Barbarians are that that kind of creatures. Barbarians she had, are she the... rolled an 18 and a 17 for Pez Justice. Oh, okay, never mind. And she's playing yeah. a dwarf. Yeah, no, no, okay, yeah, that's expected. Okay, it's fine. Yeah. So you if raise. If she was a ranger up... with that dex, she, would, she could have plus 10 to hit. Wow, 15 points of damage. damage. Uh, you hit this guy across the face with your battle axe or your greatsword. Which one do you use? It's, it's the battle axe. Because okay, so you just. On the other side, so it's, it's my battle axe right now. The you thrash him across the face. Uh, in one hit, you almost make him double over. <laughs> okay. So you you definitely took a large chunk of uh, his hit points with that. Because okay. he has double what the normal cultists have, you see. <laughs> <laughs> then I just I you know I just slash at him and then I use then I turn my my axe and I just take another swing at him. Do it. Um. For twenty-three. Hit. There we go. And second is 14. 14. Uh, you slash at him, maybe a couple of inches away from the closet uh, on the neck. He is barely standing. Okay. <laughs> he, is, he is barely standing on his feet. Nice. Yeah, that's everything for now, I guess. Okay, uh, so you see them exchanging fast looks. Um, and if you had to guess, one of them is looking at the other and saying, you stupid idiot. <laughs> and next in line after that, we have... The brand Alexander is asleep, he doesn't get a turn yet, so the Wyverns are gonna go next. Um, wait, doesn't Rastani get a turn after... No, Rastani is 7 initiative. Uh, it's Dragon Wings, Brutus, Brenda, Alexander, Wyverns, Rastani. I'm at 4. You're at 4? Sorry, I saw I'm 17 on four. you. You're a 17, that's what I see here. That's... Brenda rolled a 17. Mm. I rolled a 4. Okay, so you'd be last then. Sorry about that. Yep. Also, my squad would go same, my turn. Same so. thing, same thing. So, yeah. the Wivens would still be going, <laughs> you still not get a turn, and Rostani is not before the Wivens. So, the Wivens start charging in, and both of them attack Brenda. So, let's see how that goes. Uh, it's from the shouts, uh, from the cultists, definitely. So, let's see. Makes two attacks and bite and stinger. There we go. So we have bite and stinger attacks, uh, two of each on you. Uh, first weapon is going to be attacking. Um, we have a 13 on the bite and a 15 on the stinger. Yeah, both misses. Both misses, okay. Next in line, the next guy is going to try his luck. Okay, this is uh, a bit how we have a 21 on the bite and a 25 on the stinger. Yeah, both hits. Okay, uh, so you, I want you to do me a constitution saving throw on the stinger attack. Um, 
And it's your dwarf, right? So yeah, I have this thing has some kind of poison advantage. Or this stinger like has uh, some kind of poison. It has poison damage, so we have advantage on this one. Okay. But is it advantage? I don't know. Or it's like uh, it's, it's advantage on saving throws versus poison. She doesn't have yeah. resistance to poison. So she no, has an advantage. Wait, doesn't she have resistance as well? It is both. It is both. Okay, nonetheless, you take uh, a 13 points of damage from the bite. Uh, if you're waging, oh, no. you don't need just half. Yeah, I okay. have resistance. So, how does it go? It go does it go down or up? Yeah, uh, it's down. It's, it's down. So you, you don't right? take seven. You take There's six. No way you can fail this. No, we're not talking about that. I say we're talking about first. I was just saying the bite attack damage is so uh, six, six on her. Right? Six points of damage. Yeah. Okay. So now we need to do me a saving throw and an advantage. Uh, on saving throw with advantage yeah. for a barbarian. So that's, that's gonna be hilarious. It's going to be like a Let's plus see. eight or a plus seven. I'm not sure which one. Probably plus eight. Show us, Brenda, what you can do. Uh, let's see. Con, yeah. One. Hilarious. Two. Uh, oh, I didn't roll, did I? You yeah, rolled, I yeah, you rolled two of them. Um, yeah. So yeah, you the... barely resist the poison as the stinger... As the stinger hits you in the chest, you still take damage from it, from the piercing yeah. damage, which is six, five... 15 points of damage. And do I just do so half? Seven. Yeah, half again, half again. Uh, when I say damage, I don't take into account your resistance. Okay, you yeah, do fine. that. Yeah, just checking. Because okay. you could be like whatever of the bear and have like resistance on pretty much everything except psychic. Okay, so then. And judging by your bear hat, that might be a possibility. What? Never. How did you figure that one out? <laughs> oh! Uh, so next in line after the wizard. stack? If you have no, it doesn't. It doesn't stack. No. Okay. Resistance doesn't stack. Um, so. Rostani. It would be so funny if what it was do like divinity. If, if it was divinity or you sin, yeah, like poison resist, or you have like. Um, you, so know, you can you can actually stack them in a way. For example, take, like take AOE damage. AOE damage. If you make the saving throw and you have resistance to the element, you do take a quarter of the damage. Uh, it's well, so funny. Imagine just if, if you could stack resist and it starts healing you instead. Like in. <laughs> <laughs> there's some items. There's some items that give you like immunity if you already have resistance. Yeah. So, yep. Like if you have resistance to fire, it gives uh, okay. so you. Okay. So what's the a situation like? Uh, is there a guy still before me? Uh, no, no, it's you. It's your turn right now, and uh, like, yeah, you are surrounded is there a guy by a before. Is there, yes. is there a guy standing next to me? Two dragon wings are standing in front of you. Scimitar is still... out, uh, okay. ready to. Uh, cut you down. One of them is looking very bad. The other two wyverns. Right. One is in front of Brenda, and one is between you and Brenda, attacking. The both of the wyverns are attacking Brenda. Okay. Wow. How can they fit? Can they really fit? Like in the same space? They're so big. Oh well. But they could be. Uh, were flying, quote unquote. Uh, the dragon wings were not quote unquote flying. Exactly flying. You didn't see wings, but they were. They were. <laughs> Flying in the air. Are they in the air right now, like hacking downwards? No, no, or no, 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 no. They drop down. I mentioned okay. they drop down near you and okay. started hacking you. Uh, well, they're next to me, so any any spell attacks will be made with disadvantage. What right? do you do? Yep. Any attack spells, AOEs are not disadvantage. Yeah, I know. Well, I mean, any any AOE would probably just. I mean, a fireball would probably hit. Brenda as well, right? You're like, so you're in a line with Brenda. So if it doesn't hit you, it doesn't hit Brenda. I, mean, I kind of need some kind of like. Uh, so um, how how far is the wall? So put it like this. Um, literally, this is you're the vanguard of the army. You're front and front with Brenda. Like you are the shoulder to shoulder with Brenda. You're here. Brenda's right there, and you have weapons and dragon wings right in front of you. So they're in a line in front of you, attacking you. There's no surrounding or flanking going We're on. Standing right in line, just waiting. Yeah. So there's like, well, is there a way to just ignite them with a fireball, not hit? Them? Um, okay. definitely, definitely, you can do a fireball here, but because you're in combat and you can't, it's quite hard to see behind you to position it. I'll just give you an intelligence check. Oh. Well, to see if you can position it, quite good. 
<laughs> nope. Uh, so it's the these people are just hacking at you, trying to kill you, and you're not quite sure what will happen if you try and do a fireball right now. You definitely hit them, but you're not exactly sure if you'll be able to position it well enough not to hit you. I'm just gonna pussy out and disengage and like try to like wake up the other ones so like we're not like waking up yet. Because this shit's grey. Okay, so you disengage, you start slapping them up, they're awake. Um and I I ah, ah, I'm awake, I'm awake, I'm awake. I'm like I I move behind them. I like I move behind them because yeah, you know. Yeah, I took twenty five points of damage, I'm pretty I'm pretty big enough already as well. Awesome. So I'm, uh, leaving, I'm leaving it to the tanks. Go, go guys. <laughs> go guys. <laughs> so Rostani spends I'll her turn right waking you up, so that means that Alexander, you do actually get your turn now. Okay. I wake up. Okay, so you use happy movement to get up. I stand up. I look at these foul beasts. You look at these foul I, beasts. I charge in right next to um Right next to Brenda. And I make three attacks. Okay, do it. Uh, are you attacking the Dragon Win or are you attacking the Wivens? I'm taking the Wivens. Oh, nice, wow. good job. Okay, so. Two I think hits? the 13 is a miss, but I'll just let me check to be sure. Uh, 13 is actually a hit, sorry. All of those okay. are hits. I don't have any spell slots to expend, unfortunately. That would be really nice. Um, oh. um, 38 points of damage. Uh, uh, have you doubled I'll re your. I'll re roll that. I'll re roll the d4. Um, okay. So 37 damage. Uh, you, you, you did quit, so you can double the second attack. It is double. 3d10. But you hit plus three plus times. D4. The other one's a d4. It's with the back of the. Yeah, he oh. did d10, d10, d4, and then he added one d10. Yeah, yeah. yeah. His, so his I can put it, yeah, yeah. You, you're good. I'm, I'm the one going so crazy. So 37 here. damage. 37 points of damage. Wow. And you... my squire makes one ranged you, you, weapon you, you attack. You take a big chunk of this creature's HP out. Then the 12 is a miss though, 12 right? 12 is a miss though, yeah. Yeah, okay, so the AC is 13. Yeah, I would have told you that. Uh, so the dragon wings turn. I figured it out. You figured it out? No! Soft for my pro guys. I have to change it around now. AC 18. There we go. Uh, so the creature, the dragon the wings, tree. are actually going to uh, move out again. Uh, they're going to use their action to disengage, especially the one that's uh, very much wounded, and they're going to tap their chests and How fly. How far away are they from me? Uh, you can hit one of them. I one of them is the in your weakened reach. one that tries yeah. to disengage. Yeah, exactly the weakened one because that's between him and. Um, Do I get an advantage on this attack? No, no, because they pop their oh. chests and fly up. Oh no! Chat, chat's totally right. Your squire has plus one to hit from a magic sword. I've already, I've already added that, and it's a magic bow. It used to be plus three. Now it's plus five. No, he has a magic long sword and a magic uh, bow. It's you haven't it given him the wrong three. sword. He got a plus one to dex. You haven't given him the wrong sword. Plus five. You've okay. given him the bow, but you haven't given him the wrong sword. The yeah. magic. Oh, that's ones. right. We, we let what's his name take the long sword, even though we knew he wasn't going to be back. You you did it. Yeah, you mean uh, Brad's character. Brad's character, okay. yeah. I can't believe we got, plus one. We've gotten two plus one long bows for the record. Yeah. My next character is going to be rage based, of course. <laughs> okay, Mark. so Mark. Um, I'm assuming eleven's a miss. Uh, eleven is yes, is a miss. Uh, so okay. both of Am them. Am I awake? Uh, you are awake, Brutus, and you're actually next. Uh, That's a twenty-one. You're Cheers. not there. Can you hit him? No, oh. no, you just rolled a twenty-one. Oh, channel the oh, Okay, cool. Um. Oh, you're giving your. A little damage. I didn't realize you could do that. I can now. It's a level six feature. Oh, cool! That's cool. Okay, so you hit that one. You kill a dragon wing. Uh, the other one seems extremely frightened at this point. Uh, that you, all of you are awake and the wivens are not doing much. He's jumping back on the wyvern that hasn't taken any damage and trying to wheel him up. Brutus, it's your turn. Uh, I stand up, draw my hammer, and go stand next to the wyvern and hit. Try and hit the uh, guy who's flying it. Okay, do it. 
Uh, the creature is large, so I'm gonna give you a disadvantage in that attack. As he is especially just standing, trying not to get hit by anybody. Oh, and that because I'll hit the wyvern. Do it. Uh, Ten is a miss. So you failed. Yeah. Hit. I'll Easy. use a bonus attack. Fail God again. damn it. I'll bonus that. No, I won't. I'll save my. I'll save my last uh, divine. Um, whatever it's called. Channel divinity. There we go. I guess my turn's over. And Brenda, yeah. you're next, my lady. Is it, is there still somebody next to me that I? Can uh, do? there are uh, two weapons are next to you. Both of them are okay. the next to you. Okay, I take a Vivian. I'm good with that. That's fine. Vivian. <laughs> that's how you actually. Um, that's Romanian for Wyvern. Is was the one that I attacked already injured? Uh, the one you attacked was not injured. You injured it. Okay, so none, but neither of them were injured before that, right? Na yes, neither of them were injured before. But now there's one that's injured. <laughs> uh, yes, the one that's between you yes, and Brenda. Yes, good, good. We, we I have figured that out. We have too. concluded that one of the wyverns are injured. Brenda, do you attack the one that's injured or the, the one that's one that not injured? Uh, the, in the injured one. Okay, you hit him across the chest, thrashing him with your battle axe. Give me the damage. Is it a battle axe? Nice. Uh, second attack. Level seven barb star. Nice. Well. Nice. Twelve is a miss, unfortunately. <laughs> nice. <laughs> it is a miss. Okay. Okay, so you do that amount of damage to it, and after Brenda comes the Wyverns. Uh, the Wyvern that's going to be trying to be f flying away, uh, he's going to completely try and fly away. Uh, so use that attack. Justin. Critical hit! He does yeah, not move. You're going nowhere. You are going nowhere. Give me that damage. I've got you for three minutes. 11 damage and its rounds. movement drops to zero. I can't remember <laughs> that bones for shit. 11 points of damage. Uh, the creature was unharmed before. Now, it's taking some damage. Uh, I whisper softly to it, you're not going anywhere. You're my new ride. This Wyvern, as you whisper to it, is going to try to bite your face off and sting you in the face. Uh, okay, so biting the face off will go a 21 and the stinger will be a 23. 21 misses, 23 hits. Okay, give me constitution saving throw. <laughs> Bone saw is ready. Five Good nine. Thirteen points five. of damage, Good. and the poison does not affect you. Uh, sorry. Does it? No, it does. It's a half. Fully doesn't affect. No, it's a half. Uh, I don't have. He gets plus three saving throws when he's within ten feet of me. I did not have enough dice for this, so you take twenty-five, half of twenty-five actually. So that would be twelve points of damage, yeah. with thirteen, twenty-five points of damage total. You, mm -hmm. Both of you are within 10 feet of me, so you both make saving throws at plus 3. Oh, well, I, I made it anyway, but yeah, it would have made a, that might have made a big difference. Okay, the other uh, the other Wyvern is going to turn around towards Alexander and do the same thing. Oh, Alexander, so we have... Go, my tanks. Go. <laughs> Alexander, we have a 22 on the stinger uh, anything and about the same, a 22 17. on the bite. Anything above... 17 is a hit. Okay, so. so let's see how much damage you take from the bite. Take 11, 15 points of damage. And from the stinger, initial damage is the 10, 14. You just, how much damage was from the first one? 11 on the bite. 11. Uh, this is piercing damage. Another 14 piercing damage. So that's a total of 24, 25. 25 points of damage. And now give me a uh, constitution saving throw. I fail that, so I die. Take twenty-seven. Um, this is actually damage. gonna. This is actually gonna take me out in one hit. Are you down? Almost. Uh, yeah, I am down. Yeah, twenty-seven. Yep. That does fifty-two damage to me in one turn. Yep. Uh, so the weapons are uh, have begun their turn. Rustani. You next. Bone uh, saw is, it, is ready. Is it safer to assume that they they can be fireballed now? Um, yeah, like you're in a position that's out of combat. You can move around to position your fireball. I mean, you have complete movement and yeah, no All problem. Right. And I'll I'll fireball them. In the you fireball them in the face. 
Sorry, can I roll my new stats now? Uh, you're not you? gonna die. Mm -hmm. oh, you're not gonna die. You're, you're not oh, gonna die. Happens. You're not gonna die. You're not gonna die. Okay, because doing have, saving throws right we now. We have diamonds to revive. If if you die, we can revive you. I say, no. I don't think you we actually we actually can't because I don't character. have a third level spell slot available. But you're not gonna die. Oh, I am. Okay. I am the bragger of the cultist. Cultist fails. Cultist fails, and he burns to a crisp. So the cultist is dead. Uh, the other two wyverns, none of them are gonna die from this, but it's both just of wyverns them left, fail. Right? Yes, only wyverns. Both of the okay. wyverns fail. One of the wyvern seems extremely wounded, but the other one is is, is in a pretty good shape. Uh, not as good as he was when he first came in, but still, still a lot of HP. Still he, he a lot has of a life in him. Tan. He has he a slight tan. Yeah. Yeah, the other one's like more like a crisp. So the other one is already a crisp whip. This one is more of a in between. It's it's still in the baking pro in the making process. I think it's, I think it's Rustani. Then it, no, it's it's my turn. Then isn't it? Uh, after Rustani is Alexander. Yeah, so DST. DST. It's gonna be a one. It's gonna be a one. Oh, it's oh you one. passed! You passed a DST. <laughs> Good job. Oh High five. Oh my god! How? <laughs> um, my little squire makes an attack and misses that too. Okay. He is third because Master is dead. Rip in peace. Master, okay. Master is he's not that, is he? dead. <laughs> yeah, he's kind of. <laughs> That's not uh, a surprise. No, not again. <laughs> All right. Alex Alexander's not like, again. Alexander's like a gas <laughs> cannon, really. He doesn't. Yeah. So Alexander, it, like your your squire right now does not feel any kind of fear for his fate. After you, he saw you take down a gigantic dragon uh, by literally taking out his eyes and sp like spewing him through the eyes, he has no doubt that he can survive to quote <laughs> and small weapons like guy. This kind of reminds me of you like, uh, anytime uh, we, all, we beat this huge dragon, but these wyverns, they're the ones who done us in, darn! I mean, <laughs> two CR6s is pretty hard to deal with for um, a level yeah. 7 party. Alright, so. turn. Uh, you, uh, Alexander, that's, Dragon that's Wings, cool. they are dead. Uh, so Brutus, you're next. So I heal, uh, what's his name for six? Okay, alive. Alexander's Alexander. up. That's my last spell slot for the record. And then I grab the reins, hop onto the Wyverdon's back, and roll an animal handling check. Do it. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, opposed. Okay, interesting. Wow. Uh, you're actually, uh, um, you're, tr you're trying to subdue the creature, you're still in the process of subduing the creature, but it seems like you're successful right now. The first one is successful, you don't know how many you need to be successful to subdue them completely. I but... whisper it to it softly again, you're mine now. I've always wanted a flying mount. Oh my god, it's freaking out and it just, oh, you know, oh. it's just gonna be <laughs> It like, drops you. <laughs> it's like, Brenda, oh, it's you're next. Nice. <laughs> the Byron is tra traumatized. Like never see it looking up in the mirror and think he's pretty ever again. He's forever soil. <laughs> soil and yeah. people. He will never he will, he will never be a bride now. Okay. So uh He Brenda. might. If I get an, if I get another one I'll I'll breed uh, them and sell wyverns. That'll be my retirement. What do you do, Brenda? What's your turn? Oh, okay, let me. I see. saw you being very narrow and, and short, short sighted right now. It could be whatever so, you want. There's you one more the, of these uh, weapons yeah. that's still alive at a low HP, and the yeah, other one is be a, a bit better, but currently being mounted by your friend. Yeah, then I take the I, I attack the one who is um like weak and doesn't have anybody trying to ride. Right okay, now. cool. Give me those attacks. You are my weapon now. Quote. First attack. Bruce. Oh my wow, god. Wow, natural one. Never mind. Uh, Second attack is a 13. It's a hit. Wow, that was bad. That was quite bad. <laughs> 15 damage. Nice. Uh, I make up for it. <laughs> the weapon, uh, uh, you cut off the head of the weapon. Nice. Wait, are you attacking with one sword? Uh, he's attacking with, she's I attacking have, with I the battle. I only have a, yeah, I'm only attacking with no, it's it's my battle axe and my shield. My sword is on my back. But can't yeah. you use it two-handed? Yeah, but yeah, uh, she's using yeah, but the shield. Yeah, I can't have the shield, right? Oh, you have a shield. Okay, you have a shield. Okay. Okay. So, um, unless she's she's the party tank now, but we are the party tanks apparently. So, so <laughs> like, yeah, the wyvern, the wyvern is trying to to get 
you're out of his back. He's uh, not exactly sure what's happening. So give me uh, another oppose, animal handling. Check. Nice, yeah. okay. Uh, he seems to be... Wow. You're subduing him. You're definitely subduing him. Yeah, you're... he's definitely subduing him. One he's... more of these, <laughs> successful. And maybe you'll have under... Maybe you'll... he'll be under your command. Uh, okay. So, Gustani, it's your turn. You Do you try and do whatever. anything? Okay, so Brutus is tussling with this... Uh... Yeah, he seems to be making it. He, like... The weapon okay. is definitely subduing. It is true. It's, ca it's calming down. Kind of like, so I turn my exactly. attention to the other... It's There's one of the, nothing left. Everybody's the... dead. Oh. You still the everything. Thing... Oh, I thought that there was still a Vibrant left. Nope. No, no, no. Uh, <laughs> Gama just... beheaded it. Oh. Yep. That's it what just happened. And no, and no cultists. With, with one hand, you by the way. You burned him to a crisp. It's <laughs> uh, actually very impressive. Out of him. <laughs> For the record, it's hard to behead anything with one hand. Yeah, it's, it's pretty good. Uh, but a large is... creature, somewhat more difficult. <laughs> I'll help you go with him. I'll I'll hold uh, I'll hold uh, if that's the case, I'll hold a camp trip, Ray of Frost, in case the Vibrant seems to be making up Brutus and he can't control it. I'll try to like slow it down. If, okay, case, so you, you read your action, like shoot the Wyvern if he attacks if the Wyvern attacks Justin. Wyvern attacks anything. Like if it like if it, if it start like you know not not calming down like if it, if it, if it looks like it's calming you know, down I got like, it I got it like it's going cool. on a rampage all of a sudden I'll I'll hold a cantrip it's it cool was. uh so next in line after Alexander is uh, so after Ostani is Alexander Alexander you wake up and you remember being a... is this the weapon that attacked me Chucky no no the weapon that attacked you is, has been beheaded okay cool. I try and put my hand on the woman's face. That's all I do for my turn. Does it try and bite my hand off? Yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. But first, we have Brutus. On his turn. Before we do, Brutus, give me that animal handling check. Wow. My friend, you have officially subdued. This the is the weapon. first time my animal handling's ever been relevant in this campaign, for the record. I've been trained in animal handling since level one. Brutus has completely subdued the weapon. It's my <laughs> wyvern now. Hey guys, I got us a ride. We can get out of here whenever we want. <laughs> uh, the wyvern could not. I mean, the wyvern would fall off the sky if he would be to carry all of you. Well, we could, we could, we could ferry people one at a time. We just could, could like have a diet or something. He could, he could, know, he could like, maybe, he could maybe carry weight. two at the same time, but he would be moving a lot slower. That's fine. Um, yeah, we can ferry. Like we just can like ride it. Like you know, you know, uh, you know, command it. Like you can know, just go one by one. Okay, so you now have a pet wyvern. On the Wyvern's well, turn. Well, we'll name him Slant. The Wyvern's right turn time. does not actually <laughs> bite you. Like, he's completely subdued. He's now cowering before before Brutus. Cowering below Brutus, Chucky. Below. He's riding it. Yeah, yeah, good point. He's basically just, he, he's subdued right now. He's uh, only, docile. Only the Indies. Only, only in the Indies. As docile as a Wyvern can be. It's <laughs> Wyvern is the kind of creature that you know you don't pay attention a couple of seconds to and he will bite your hand off. I've Justin, Justin I make does some, like Justin does some how to train your dragon shit where he like I don't know, like he like pokes in a certain area and then like it's fucking like spines come out of some shit and then like now it's better at flying. Fuck if I know. Okay, so uh, movie, Justin, how to train your uh, from now on um, <laughs> So you have to do this creature, you have proven to it that you are its superior, uh, but at the same time the creature has been trained by uh, the Code of the Dragon. So anytime that you'll need to fight somebody from the Code of the Dragon, like a cultist or something of the sort, uh, you need to basically do an opposed animal handling check uh, with his uh, morale check, to put it like that, like a wisdom saving throw for him. That's fine. Doesn't, uh, doesn't like, uh... I, uh, I, I get out my, my wyvern cloak, or my, 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 hor the dragon queen cloak I have, and I put it on the dead body of one of the handlers, and I'm just like, attack him, attack him! And we uh, go through this, until he, get used, he gets used to attacking things in, uh, in, you know, Tiamat cloaks. I go back to sleep. Uh, well, he sees it's a dead body, when you say attack him, attack him. He he just beats him. Yeah, that's fine. That still counts. He's attacking. He, 
I, I'm breaking down his symbology of authority. Okay. At this point, I probably remove my cloak so he doesn't get any like you know. <laughs> about <laughs> Yeah, me my too. Cloaks, my Good cloak's gone. long removed. There's no point in us having them anymore. Anything yeah. that fights us wants yeah. to It's, yeah. Because right. apparently, apparently we... Yeah. Uh, I, 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 I praise the Wyvern afterwards. I'm like, Good Wyvern, you're a good Wyvern. You like, throw like a bit of like a meaty flesh from the arm. You're like, Hey boy, catch. Good boy. <laughs> They're just like, Who's your good uh, boy? Who's your just good just boy? put it out there. There's still Wyverns outside screeching. They're not they're yeah, coming, coming like, in, but they're still patrolling. What there are? There are still uh, weapons out there. This, these are not. These are not the only ones. I'm gonna die this session. Okay, I heal myself up and I start sleeping. I heal myself for thirty-five. No, thirty. Thirty. You try to sleep again, everybody. And I go back to sleep. Yeah, I'd be like, that was a good illusion. You should do that again, and I, I'll go back to sleep. <laughs> There's a weapon there. <laughs> yeah, the weapon's fine. Like. <laughs> Okay, uh, so you like, guys continue on sweeping, let me, let me start <laughs> rolling so some just, dice. Just for the record, right, and just, just for the flavor, as soon as Brenda just calms down again, like the beard disappears, like whoop, and then she takes takes off her, her beer hood. So yeah. <laughs> you, you hear, you hear... Well, let me see, bro, this Brutus... Brutus actually did notice that you slightly transformed into a bear. Okay, he was like, that's cool, that's a neat trick, I like no, that one. It's a beard, it's a beard. <laughs> So, you're actually, uh, there it's is bad, one it? time when it seems like you're very close to another encounter with a couple of cultists and their uh, weapons, but it seems for some reason, uh, they hear, they just start up at something, they just stare up, it seems like somebody's talking to them, but you don't hear who or what's happening, or you don't see anybody talking to them, and they mount up their weapons and go off. Alright, well in that case I get to finish my long rest, so I got all my spell slots back. Yeah, or you get I just wanna like point out like how long have we been doing this because like That was another three hours. Yeah, uh, but we're soon we're soon to no, reach no, our no, destination. No 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 you've uh, you've swept eight hours. No, you're not soon to reach your destination. Uh if you remember correctly you did, uh, they are stopping at other uh, like spots in the Wormspoke Mountains to gather more route from other places. When you talk oh. to the other, you talk to a dragon wing, I think. Exactly, it was actually um, your half work friend, uh, Robert's character. Uh, Ogre? Half? Oh, no, half no, no, Robert's character. Okay, not the half Ogre. Uh, I'll, pro I'll probably be very exhausted at this point. I probably will have to sleep as well. Yeah, you. so your friends sleep. Yeah, okay, you we take sleep. turns guarding, I suppose. No? I guess yes. I, I can just stay. I mean, for a short rest, you don't need yeah. to sleep, right? So I could no. just stay up. In another hour, I'll be able to stay awake for the rest of my um, long rest. Uh, just... No, because your long rest was interrupted and you just started again. Yeah. I just sleep for a six hours. A fight like that is a, is, is a long rest. That... Oh, fine. I go back to sleep for six hours then. Okay, so yeah. You well, all, I you all actually, as I said, you all managed to make the long rest because I ordered this and I told you that you had a close encounter, but they didn't actually come through and attack you, didn't see you. So okay. you have taken a full rest, you have your HP back, your spells back, your abilities, and half your hit dice rounded up. I wish okay. we were closer to the level. I have all my hit dice and I have everything. I am. I wake up and I'm like, wow, I feel unhealthily healthy. <laughs> Thank you, based for easy rest. Yeah. <laughs> we're, we're like eight, we're eight and a half k away from uh, good God, there's no, like there's no way these time. creatures are gonna give you that much HP. But I will tell you exactly how much you get. Uh, for the fact that you defeated the Wyvern but you uh, tamed it, I'm gonna give you five billion XP. Bo That's a, enough to level us up to 8,500. <laughs> <laughs> Is that how much uh, we need? 1,450 yes. 1, XP each. 1,450 each? Each, yes. Okay. That's not too bad. Chucky, I, I guess I started with, like, the starting XP of level 7, right? Yes. I don't think it the matters for you, ben, no. to, be, to okay. be quite frank. Chucky, you rolled for this wyvern. You never know. Already, right? I mean, there might be another uh, thing. Yeah. Like, I'll give you. If, I'll give if you. If we fight three more dragons, you may not level up. 
So I give you. Uh, I'll well, give you the HP if he survives this session, Buddhist. I will give you like he'll make he'll be your henchman if he survives this session. Until okay. then, I have his HP right in front of me. Okay. <laughs> That's a strong ass henchman. A tiny bit stronger than my squire. <laughs> Only just. Okay, so you guys my wake up. Is smart. And it's Can weird. wyverns use bows? Can I give the, my wyvern the magic bow? <laughs> no, it's it's very <laughs> weird. You don't hear the screeching. <laughs> you do not hear the screeching of wyverns anymore. Uh, suddenly they stopped for some reason. You're not exactly <sighs> sure why. Alright. Um, do we have to do anything else in this castle, guys? Are we... I, I, I just we, we have a fly mouth now we just fuck off <laughs> Br Br brutus has like fish memory like why are we in this castle we were supposed to kill the dragon i assume we were supposed to uh destroy the cleric do you do you, do you do you remember born Frey, brutus yeah that i day? remember born Frey. yeah we have to fuck him up how about first we kill talus then born Frey? we have to be the rulers of this castle oh yeah and then God, no! See, Brutus, Brutus didn't think about this before. Brutus is like, oh, we could have a flying castle. That's even better than a flying mount. In, <laughs> but to do this, we need to befriend the, the giants. And they want a job done. Alexander! You hear a voice oh, oh. echoing through the tunnels. Do you recognize the voice? You what, do not recognize it? the voice. But it's very deep and extremely loud, above any that a human can do, even with this level of echo. You fucked up. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't fuck up. He said not to kill. He said not to kill the high priest, and he said not to um, stop this castle from flying to its destination. I did neither of those things. So I'm perfectly fine in this. Situation. Do you? Do you? Do you? What do you spawn? Do you anything? You... I shout back. Yes. Go out here! Uh, it's coming from somewhere from the main vault. Okay, I'm gonna go to uh, yes, the dragon Yes, I'm gonna go to the main vault. I'll start walking. Okay. And sounds like trouble to me. I mean... You, yeah, I'm gonna hang out back here. Uh, you go talk to that giant, I guess, and you figure want, out what's you going want, on. You want me to, to come with you or something? You can come with me. Anyone who's man enough can come with me. Okay. Um. I'm gonna st I'm gonna stay here and pet Flighty. <laughs> Flighty. I have named the wyvern Flighty. Alexander looks disappointed. Actually, will Flighty fit through the tunnel? Yeah. Uh, I, I, no, Flighty not through that tunnel. He he'd have to go through here, like into the down into where the dragon hold was, and then, and then fly, fly up. up. It's fine. It's perfectly achievable. Yeah. I'm not saying that he can't do it. It's just gonna he no no way he goes down this way or the other way. All right. Well, I I'll take Flighty down the main tunnel then. Okay. Wait, why don't we just block them in the, like the ends of that then and just like keep stabbing at them while like just can't reach us. And like yeah yeah or shooting them with the bow. Because Chucky will find some way to fuck us if we try something retarded. He's like the cavern <laughs> starts <laughs> collapsing and we're like. Yeah. <laughs> Not to meta game or anything, but it'll happen. No. Paste in eyes. That's the same thing. Like my character tried. If, if, if he does that, we just have to report, report his stream for sexual content. There you go. Or we could make the sexual content. I mean, oh like the cameras are right here. Like just you know, stand up, pants down. Easy I, band, Chucky. I, I easy like, band. I like we how Fiamma, Fiamma is just like. We have all the power here, Chucky. The things I could say. The things I could say. Yeah, I could. <laughs> okay, I could so see what, see what the about, is about my morning. You move out uh, into the main vault and you see the twenty-three foot high crowd giant um, standing in front of you with his big gigantic. Uh, boulders into his holster on him. Uh, he seems to be he has boulders actual... on him. He's just like carrying around this boulder, like Rrr. no, he, no, he doesn't have an on him. Like holsters, which are like as you'd have uh, uh, bullets for your swing shot in a holster. That's how he has like giant boulders. Yeah. Okay. Well. I'm gonna say, well met. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so well, very good. 
<laughs> you didn't manage that to was fuck a things up here. Excuse me? <sighs> I didn't you... hear what you said, Chucky. Oh, uh, he said you didn't manage to fuck things up here. You didn't? You did. You did. Oh. <laughs> How? <laughs> We had Yo. an agreement, and this wasn't part of it. You never said anything about stopping by killing this dragon. No, but I didn't anticipate what they would do. Killed a vampire. Uh, nobody really minded too much. No one trying to find you. But after you killed a dragon... Put it like this, if they didn't, they didn't have anybody to blame, so... They started pointing fingers. Most of my ogres are now dead. But Resmir and his acolytes are holed up in the fortress. My island golems are keeping them in there, but I don't know how much we can keep them inside. We need I you to move them out. I say, I'm, I'm so sorry. I didn't think that this is what... <sighs> roll, Chris, roll persuasion. You, roared, <laughs> no, you don't need to. Uh, you kept your promise. Can I try and seduce the um, giant Chucky. How do you think you giant? No, I'm just kidding, Chucky. I'm just kidding. You kept your part of the I agreement. Pointed, I pointed a small, small dong, and I'm like, small. You can, you can a small dong. Did I hear that right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he says, "Roll them out, kill them, and I'll take you to where I'm assembling my army. If you're so adamant on taking the cold town, I think I could use your spirit." And your stories to raise up the other crowd giants to fight. Perfect, let's do it. Oi! Let's go then! No way I'm getting to the Well of Dragons with this. Go kill them. They're in their castle. Nobody will touch you. And if you dare run, we'll find you. Well, Very well. The giant man. He actually does seem a fairly wounded himself. Now that you're looking um, at him, like he seems fairly wounded. We could, we could totally kill him in. <laughs> How much XP is he worth? Wait. As, as much, not, not as much as the dragon, as much as the dragon, I believe. Ah, oh, really? I think. No, so. no, we made a deal. I'm not, we're not. I'm not. I'm not. My character wouldn't just go out and kill him. I yeah, think. Brutus wouldn't do that either because we made a deal with him. Apparently, even though I don't remember. Cause no, 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 only, only Maybe I stand dragon. I don't know. He's he's around that CR, I think. But I think whatever. he's actually more powerful than the dragon. One second. No, we're not going to attack him, so it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We're not going to attack him. <laughs> you don't okay. even need to look it up. So, um, yep, you guys, as I said, um, go on. What do you do? Yeah, Very let's, well. kill, let's kill some... Let's sit off. We shall half dragons. find our way. Yeah, let's, let's kill some people. This guy's awesome. nowhere near as powerful as the... Br as Brutus no. perks up at the idea of killing people. Someone mentions that we're going to go kill some people. He's like, who? Where? The Rest bad guys. They're in the castle. They just slaughtered the half of us. Brutus, Brutus does like a loop-to-loop -loop on the wyvern. He's like, woo-ha! <laughs> Bold dexterity <laughs> to stay on. <laughs> I, just take, I just take the sword from my back and I just uh, have a very... I, I look very determined and I just start walking into a direction but I really have no idea where we're going so just like I just start walking into some way is it time for our next break already uh it is yeah. actually time for our next break yeah. wow okay it's going Fighting. very fast <laughs> takes a while <laughs> alcohol <laughs> makes time weird okay so we're gonna see you guys in about two three minutes with more of your dragon queen see you soon